Hello, hello, veggie fam. It's your girl, Ashley of Robles Veggies, coming in with another Test Tuesday, the first one of this new year, yes. And if you clicked on the thumbnail, you already know why you're here. We're gonna be reviewing Starlight Cuisines Plant-Based Beefy Taquitos. Yes, because I was just in the mood of a taquito. I haven't had one in like years. And I was like, well, how can we go about doing this? And then boom in the freezer aisle there was there was staring at me so i had to give it a try and if this is your first time tuning in thank you guys so much this is how we do we take a vegan plant-based product we taste test it we give a star ready and we wrap up the video at the end because why spend that money honey why spend that money honey if you don't have to i'll do it for you also shout out to the veggie fam that made it here we are in a new year y'all thank y'all for riding with me Thank you for, you know, had to get it together in the new year, honey. The year in, okay? For all of y'all who have like full-time jobs too and trying to balance, did it take you out? Honey, okay? I needed a break. So we are back and ready to get into these reviews. So you know how I do, I do the overhead so you can see what all the ingredients are and then we taste test it. So let's get to it, shall we? And boom, here's that closer look. Plant-based beefy taquitos made with corn tortillas, okay? Not flour, corn, all right? And they let you know right away it's vegan, gluten-free, good source of fiber, non-GMO, honey, all right? And then moving on along to the ingredients, okay? It's right on this side, and you know we do the top five, okay? It's telling you it's the corn tortillas, you got water, texturized soy flour, onion, and then mushroom, which I'm assuming the mushroom is going to give you that meaty beefy okay now getting into the calories and all the nutritional facts honey okay you get one serving size is one taquito all right you have um for the sodium only 80 milligrams which i'm kind of shocked i was expecting this to be a little salty i don't know why but 80 is real low, um low on the you know spectrum from some of the other products we've tested and taste tested so this is actually doing pretty good now y'all know i'll be having to open these up um off camera because they be trying to play me and i look crazy so hold on okay so oh it looks like all of them is in one big package okay so this is like if you're doing this by yourself i guess you'll have to just put it in like a freezer bag but this will be perfect for a party or entertaining, okay? Single serving. Now, let's see how it tastes because that's the real thing, okay? If it don't taste good, whew, we may be in trouble, so stay tuned. Okay, you guys, I'm trying something new this year. I'm going to be seated. <laughs> or at least for, let's see, let's test it out for this video because I'm like, sometimes I just want to have a seat and eat, you know, comfortably, you know? Um, so, anywho, <laughs> here's the brief video of how it looks like for the cook time and stuff they have four different ways you can kind of prepare it you can either do it through the skillet oven air fryer and microwave but the best one i think they said was the oven and the air fryer so i went ahead and did the oven they said you can put it in there for up to like 22 minutes and um or no 20 minutes 20 minutes so i did 10 minutes on one flipped it 10 minutes on the other and this is what you get now, I cut it in half because I just wanted y'all to see kind of what it looked like on the inside. Is it gonna focus? Okay, so it cut out, so <laughs> had to make some storage, but anyway. Here you go, let's taste test it, okay? It's still warm, so let's see. Hmm. Take another bite. Let me get some water. Okay, so let's get into the things that I love. All right, I like the crunch. I'm enjoying the crunch. It is, gives a nice little crunchy to it, um, which is nice. Um, the tortillas taste pretty fresh, to be honest. Um, so I like that. Um, and it was easy to make. It was very convenient, very like, you know, Quick and easy. I could see this being a favorite, like for parties when you're just like, oh, I don't feel like doing a lot of cooking. This might be a good little cute little appetizer. However, we're gonna slide into the love me nice and I'm gonna break down what I'm really feeling, okay? So, although I love the crunch, I do kind of like the convenience and everything. I didn't really taste like the filling. 
excuse me, all I'm really tasting is the, um, the tortilla, just the wrapped up tortilla. And I know I mentioned before, like I couldn't really tell what was on the inside. Like you, as you can see, it's mainly tortilla. So that was my, like, love me not the biggest one. I don't think there's enough filling in there to really say it's like a beefy. I don't know. It just made it off top, just looking at the visuals and stuff. I'm like, man, it's going to be like nice filling inside and really like yummy and beefy and cheesy, whatever. But it's like you don't really get a lot of filling. So it's really just you tasting tortilla, which I mean, it's good, but I need some dipping sauce. I need some things with it. You know what I'm saying? You know? So with that being said, with it not really being enough filling, I would give this a 3.5 stars just because, yeah, I'm not getting enough filling. I would, you know what, actually, let me say three stars. I would give it three out of five stars because I like the crunch. I think it would, you know, I like the crispy, the crunch and everything. And I just think if they really just put a little bit more filling on the inside, it would like boost up my star rating. You know what I'm saying? Um, but yeah, I don't know. Y'all let me know. And we are wrapping up the video. What do y'all think? What do y'all think? Would you give this product a try? Have you tried it before? Did you get the same feels as I did? Let me know. Comment below. And thank you guys so much for tuning in with your girl Ashley of Frog Liz Veggies, where we're always cooking up fresh greens on the daily. Again, here are all of my socials to stay up to date with me throughout the week. And thank you guys so much for watching.